Ooh. Wow, perfect, right? So whenever you click this menu, it's going through the edge this. Hey guys, this is Angga Rizky from Indonesia and welcome back to my video in YouTube. In this tutorial, we're going to design the navigation set for the Adobe XD. Well, basically in the previous video, we designed for a timeline, right? So maybe you can watch my previous video. So in this video, we'll continue the design. Okay. So we just need to duplicate this screen A and I will give the name to screen B. Cool. And after that, I will delete all of those layer in the screen B because I don't need anymore. Okay. And in the screen B that we design the gradient color linear gradient color from the left and to the right okay and i will use the first color this blue uh, i have to copy the hex code and make it again again that was mistake for me okay and after that, we select this color and make uh, like this. Okay, and we are going to save this color to the assets by click here. So it's gradient, pretty nice. Ah, uh, wait, I think it's not really cool. <gasps> It's not really cool. So we have to copy here and um, I'm thinking, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Okay. No, no, no. What do you think, guys? Is it beautiful? I don't think so. So I think we can use this. Okay, just click right to delete and at any game. Cool. In the screen A, that we able to export that design selected and to desktop with the design option, not web, iOS, even Android. So here we just need to copy and put in the screen B oops and then I will change this we are going to map to the center and like this okay but I'm still don't like this gradient so I think I can first I will change this and select this to change this no 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 we copy the first hex code and we re-enter this oh I have to change the direction first from the top to the bottom and then I have to change this to be dark. This okay sounds it's very nice now. So we are going to duplicate this layer, the screen A, just common D, and in the screen A here you can turn the left and make it small and make to the center. Okay, and then you can set in the opacity to 5. Okay, but in this design, we, did, we need the shadow. And in this design, also, we need the shadow. 
and then we copy again we press and we make to the middle middle okay and move and change the layer to the button so you will get the illusion like this pretty nice okay and we just need to create the menu here mm, nice no 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 i will create the rectangle about this size instead of using the image for the illumination first i will setting this remove the border and remove that that and make below of the screen a and give the shadow and change the opacity to the 80 and duplicate and resize again okay yeah this is pretty nice instead of we are using the image that make illusion that's something i don't like so we are going to continue so i have prepared three icons that you can use it i will prepare in the symbol but first you don't have to forget to download my project in the description on my video okay first of all i want to resize the size maybe uh, 24 okay and then i will make symbol that you can use it for the project don't forget to ungroup the symbol if you want to edit just click layer ungroup symbol and then you edit it okay cool now here so basically when i click this uh plus button it's it's going through this menu okay so let's to create menu here I will create the text here. Mm, photograph with this style and the color should be white. Oh my god. Adobe HD is easy to use, right? Mm, how about this? Which one you like? First, I will make thumbs. No, 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 no copy create ungroup. Okay, and then we duplicate this, and then I will copy, I will cut press here and we want to delete the camera and photograph we change to nearby story and make it to middle okay now oh, we have Dude. so we just need to duplicate and this we cut to here oh this way should be okay and then delete the placeholder and make to the middle and I call it direct message. Ok. 
Okay. Sounds nice. In the photograph that we are using this the color have to be mm, have to be white. Have to be white and the last one have to be white and then we are going to change this distance okay nice and this is the menu we give the margin to 40 sorry 36 and I want to create the special button here for the lockout so we are going to use the rectangle and just like this and setting the radius to 100 remove the border and group it and give the name uh, btn and this is btn and we make it to the low like this and of course to make it um, to make it not really highlight that we can use this okay so it's not really highlight right and we just need to copy this and paste here sync up sync off okay nice and actually I want to create my profile name here so this is the margin to 69 so yeah here I'm going to create the ellipse for the profile profile okay and I will remove the border and group it and give the name profile pick in the profile pick that we have and uh, we can provide the picture of our face okay this is from symbol and just ungroup symbol and after that you move this and ellipse object and make switch shape and click here to change it like this and change like this and tara you got the face and the profile fig that we can provide the shadow mm, wait try to increase or oh, it doesn't affect so you have to copy this ellipse and pass only for your shadow okay we try okay so there's shadow nice and we just need to provide name and location angariski and we are using the sorry the symbol this one angariski but the color have to be white color and then we duplicate this Jakarta Indonesia and change here and color is white and now look very nice okay 
and after that we are going to grouping this dust layer and of course we have many here okay it's easy right and then I will try to make the prototype for those screens so when I whenever I click this it's going through this layer okay so we're going to make prototype here and I select this button and then I will direct to here and the transition should be uh, fed off I think we have to use fed off but it's okay select right and easy in okay and after that whenever I click this it's going back to this screens it have to be slight left with the easy out okay now we are going to try to play this okay so I click this wow Ooh. wow perfect right so whenever you click this menu it's going through the edge design pretty nice well don't forget to appreciate it by like comment share with your friends nice to meet you from indonesia and goodbye